Lock in place from Shaw is the fastest, easiest to install laminate flooring. Simply slip, lock and drop angle, drop and lock. It's that easy, that fast. Lock in place requires minimal tools and preparation. Start by clearing the room of previous flooring and removing trim. Undercut door to provide clearance for the new floor. First, roll out underlayment along the longest wall. Tape across strips every few feet to hold seams together. Run the underlayment up the wall at least two inches. Base molding will cover this. If you're installing over concrete as shown here, fully tape the seams. Now it is time to plan your installation. First measure the room and decide the direction planks will be laid. Calculate how many plank widths will be needed to span from wall to wall. Plan for a one quarter inch gap between your floor and each wall. Try to use rows of planks the same width at opposite sides of the room. As you assemble your floor, pull planks randomly from cartons to ensure the best look. Begin assembly out from the wall. Start by laying down a row of planks with the tongue facing the wall. Start your second row beginning at the left. Add planks working to the right. Lower planks to the floor to lock. Remember to leave a quarter inch gap between the ends and the walls. Lock in place is that fast and easy. Continue across the room adding rows. With most installations, you must install around door jams, under cabinet toe kicks, and other more difficult areas. But lock in place makes even these challenging installs easier. Here are some tips. First, remember that the one quarter inch gap must be maintained around cabinets, pipes, toilet flanges, and other obstacles and floor. When you're installing flooring that will run through a door, make sure you adjust the plank so there's a transition seam in the middle of the doorway. This makes it easier to fit planks at the door jam. Be sure to measure and notch around both sides of the door jam, and make sure your trim planks are cut large enough to fill in under the trim door jam. When working in tight spaces, you may be unable to lift the planks three inches high to lock into place. This is quickly solved by removing the locking ridge from the groove. Use a wood chisel or rasp to remove the ridge. Apply a 1 8 inch bead of adhesive to the tongue and push into place. Put strips of painter's tape on the planks to hold in position until the adhesive dries. Clean up the excessive adhesive. Now stand back and enjoy your beautiful new floor. A new floor made easier by lock in place and shawl.